Project Zoika. That's what the intel on Oasis pointed to. Valen's mysterious mission in Africa. I was supposed to find answers, but left with more questions. My orders are to find out what the informant knows, to fill in the blanks. Problem is, he's being held at a POW camp to the north. And the only way through is how fire fast. I'm hitching a ride with a long-range desert group. But the Germans have dug in with flak 88s and a heavy motor pool. We can't afford a massive firefight. I'll have to take out the guns and help the LRDG push through. The pass is heavily fortified with plenty of narrow spaces, close quarter surprises. I'll need to watch my six and pack a couple of mines to cover a quick exit. I suppose they don't call it Hellfire Pass for nothing. Everybody, and welcome back to Sniper Elite 3 where they oh fuck me that's where you switch ammo good god I'm a fucking idiot all right so it turns out I have my armor piercing rounds all along I forgot that they weren't in the wheel and that you just hit Y when you have your rifle up so yeah I'm dumb uh, so yeah this is mission 3 Halfaya Pass uh, I don't remember this one being too bad I remember having to use the well rod a lot in the beginning because like we end up going through a bunch of very small narrow paths um so you know to find the guys that we need to take out requires a bit more close range like see like there's that guy right there you know who's apparently fairly blind uh, i don't think that there's ooh, I don't think that there's very many people here, but uh, I know that there's like, they're actually strategically placed. They're not just like scattered wherever. Now, hopefully that guy doesn't good. Now we can sneak past these guys, obviously. <clears throat> with very little effort, but the other thing we can do is sneak around them, so. Also, if my audio sounds a little bit different today, it's because I didn't really feel like doing the whole setup. Uh, so, my phone is a little bit further away from me than it normally is, but it should, I imagine, be fine. The audio levels look uh, about the same, so. All right, so I got a guy on my left and the guy on the right that almost spotted me. Hoping to get a shot at that guy, but whatever. That's why he didn't come and investigate, because he was on one of those. Alright, so now I saw a guy up there. There he is. Damn, it's not considered close enough. If the reticle isn't red, you really don't want to shoot. Uh, it can still hit, and it can still kill, but red means that that's where your bullet is going, and it will be effective. Like that. Uh, okay, so that's... Now, <clears throat> uh, there are no collectibles. Oh, wait, no. There is one collectible, I guess, in this part, which is actually somewhere, I guess, along this wall. If we... And there it is. Yeah, it's actually just a little bit ahead of us. Apparently, which is a little strange but whatever imagine it would be around here just because like this stuff is here I don't know what it is though so ah, probably over here if I had to guess yeah there it is 
some random little campfire, which to be fair, it is smart because it's guarded from the elements, but uh, General Valor may very well be a military genius, but his constant demands and requisitioning of supplies and men are hampering my efforts to maintain the security of our recent gains. None dare question or speak out against him. I mean, that was the issue with uh, the Germans in World War II, right? It wasn't that they didn't necessarily have the strength to take everything. It's that they didn't have the the numbers to keep it is the issue, right? Which I guess is a lot of... All right, so my capture froze. And I'm not exactly sure when, so we're... So I hit restart checkpoint. Which is unfortunate, but, you know... Not really a huge amount I can do about that. Okay, so we'll see. So I got that guy there that I can't quite see over the lip. Got this other guy here who's coming down. Because he heard me walking. But that's fine because he's gone now. There he is. And there he goes. Okay. okay. So that's, I think actually one, well, uh, everybody that we know is over here. Okay, so we can go across that way. We can go across the bridge there. Not actually sure. We know that there's some trucks across the way, but we haven't found anything to cover our noise yet. Uh, I mean, obviously I could set off explosions to cover a shot or two, but that requires a lot of things to work in your favor. Cause I mean, it's obviously easy enough to set the, uh, to set the flint down to set off an explosion. But, make sure nobody's fucking looking at me this time while I do this. Um, but obviously you then have to have the shot lined up. Also not that difficult, but you have to hope that the person that you're trying to kill is within the shot, you know? Like, you don't want to set it off and then have him fucking move just as the explosion goes off because you wouldn't have time like if you're going to do that while it is oh in the radio menu what okay oh look at that son of a bitch you can do well well you know um you basically want somebody who isn't going to be moving like you want somebody who's like leaning against something or whatever um and they're not going to move because I mean it's 20 seconds for the flint to set something off and 20 seconds while not a huge amount of time number one find those 88s um, it is an insane amount of time when you take into consideration you know like when you need something somebody to not move oh something is Oh, you know what? I think they might actually be... Oh, the truck's backfiring. Okay. That's... Okay, I can, I can work with that. It's not the best, but... It'll work. It doesn't give me a huge amount of time. I want to say, like, there's this little house here, and I want to say that there's definitely someone there. Like, I remember there being, I feel like, more guys here. I could obviously be wrong, but... Alright. Okay. A lot of that actually went... Yeah, that actually went on for quite a while. Like, holy hell. Okay, wait for it. For it. Come on. Come on. Start her up again. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. There it is. Alright, I might have to go and close my door because it sounds like somebody's mowing their lawn or something outside. 
but it sounds pretty far away at the moment, so I don't think it's here. Oh, I see you up. Oh shit, I missed you. Okay, where's the other guy? There he is. Okay. Oh, I'm not gonna be able to shoot you through that wall. Damn it, nope, alright, that's fine, that's fine, we got patience. That's what being a sniper is all about, is patience. See, now I think that when I first played this mission, I for some reason didn't register that as a, uh, as a person doing it. And I think I like wandered out in front of that truck, which obviously, as you can imagine, does not go well. You know. When, uh, because not only did I then get spotted, I also lost my, uh, my sound. I was going to say soundproofing. That's not accurate. I don't like this. Oh, okay. I see. Come on, buddy. Start it up before this guy sees me. Come on. Come on, coincide with him poking his head up. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, come on, come on. Damn it. I, I mean, I, I imagine that that didn't actually alert him or anything, but. Oh, come on, come on. Damn it, missed it. I could have maybe got it off, but... Okay, let's see, we got that guy there. I'm gonna see if this other guy will go back to his post, because if he does, I should be able to tag him on the way. Gotta keep my eye out for... Ah, oh, damn it, that guy. Fucking Cruz is up there. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to shoot him when he's doing that. Because, I mean, he's really... It's a good thing that they'll never fix that truck, you know. Okay, I'm trying to keep my eye on the left and, the, like, on top of the roof and on the left to see if that guy will patrol back that way, but... Oh. Oh. What? Squeeze me? There we go. I hate the fucking, like, it doesn't, like, I understand how the diamond works, but just sometimes it just doesn't seem to. Okay. That guy down. That guy there should be easy enough to take care of. Oh, this guy's going to be in a good position here in a second. Mask. Should be. Oof, while you're on a ladder. See, ladders, they're not safe. That's why I don't trust them. I don't use ladders. You never know when you'll be climbing up one and just all of a sudden your head explodes. Oof, I almost pulled the trigger there, but I saw that it was going away and I don't know. I'm pretty sure as long as the symbol is still on your screen, you're good. You may even have half a beat afterwards to do it but it's just not something that you really want to play with oh don't go behind the crate oh you went behind the crate and i don't know if i can shoot through it oh just come out the other side come on, come on. oh that wasn't a uh all right so that <laughs> i okay so he went into the building then i guess. oh no there's a little wall there all right fine okay that guy's not there I'm get this guy because I hear the truck starting up again. There we go. I feel like that might take off the front of his face. Oh, or just most of his head entirely. Alright. Okay. This guy next. Oh. Being saved by that guy letting off the gas there. Okay. 
Come on. Do it again before he walks away. Nope, there he goes. This guy. Bye to you. Now, hopefully the guy in the truck didn't notice that. I did honestly kind of worry that, but only after I fired the shot, so it wouldn't have mattered either way. But apparently he did not notice the guy having the smoke outside his window just fucking drop dead. Okay. See, it, okay, well that's actually a plane, not a, not a lawnmower anymore. Oh, come on, come on, come on. There we go. Now he's inside the building, which could be risky, because there could be somebody else in there. That I just don't know about yet, but seems like we're good. Alright, how many do I think are up there? Um, I don't see any more. That doesn't necessarily mean that they're not there. Now, another thing I could do is explode one of these trucks and, uh,. You know, obviously that will stop the noise from the truck, but that's fine because it looks like I'm going to be pretty close quarters from now on. So, don't really have to worry about that. Now I could have kept him up, but uh, the reason I didn't was because I was worried. Oh, is that just the one guy and he's holding? Oh, okay, that's a grenade that he's got. Okay, that guy. Okay, I'm climbing out the back here, but I don't know. I guess there's a ladder there to go up higher. And I don't know how many guys there are. Hang on a second. Oh, you know what? That might be... Oh, wait, actually, do I want to do that? I'm pretty secure, I think. There's probably still at least one more person in there, but I don't know that. But I forgot that they drop weapon parts. Although, once again, I doubt that I'll actually need any of them. Uh, but I should probably loot the ones that I can easily get to. Yeah, that guy must not... I wonder if that was the guy then who was then patrolling inside. Maybe. Oh, he had a bandage. That's good. Okay. So we'll head in. Now, I do plan to blow up those trucks at some point, but I want to make sure that this little... I don't know, valley section, whatever that we're in. Like, if we look at the map here, like, we're there. So I want to make sure that, like, this little valley section is clear... Oh, there's actually a sniper nest there. Okay. I don't know what I'll be sniping from there, but... My mind. I didn't bring any of those with me. Oh, look at that. Any important intel. Got it. Uh, to all officers, the Overseer of Defenses will inspect our fortifications in the pass over the next few days. His word should be considered law as we seek to consolidate our defensive lines against the approaching allied forces. Needless to say, he is to be guarded and kept safe in the event of an attack. For information on the schedule, report to the Central Communications Outpost near the well. Oh, that was actually a war diary. All right. Let's take that, obviously. Uh, I am still really hoping for a noisemaker. Now, granted, there is a... Uh, right. I actually need to press the button to get on the ladder. Uh, I've been playing Far Cry 5. Ah, uh, well, not Far Cry 5. Far Cry New Dawn. So I'm hitting, like, all the buttons that you use for that game, <laughs> not this one. Uh, I'm enjoying it so far. I mean, I decided to do it because after we're done this game, I uh, actually bought Wolfenstein. And I figured those would make better. Because I was planning on doing this one and then Far Cry. Since I did Far Cry 5, I figured I should probably do New Dawn since it takes over after that. But... Um, and then at the same time, open world games are a little bit harder for recording purposes because obviously there's a lot more to do in between parts. 
And then Wolfenstein was on sale. So I got Wolfenstein the Old Blood and the New Order for $7.50 each. Mark those two. Climb up here. I think I sniped somebody off of here. I did. Okay, now. I'm going to save my game here. I realize saving over it is, you know, not necessarily the best idea, but at the same time, the only thing it really affects is collectibles. And uh, you're pretty screwed with collectibles anyway. Now I can obviously try and take both of you, and I will actually. Nailed it. Perfect. Could not have... Excuse me, what was that? Nothing? Good. Better not be anybody. Fucking did that perfectly. Unlike in Far Cry New Dawn, where... I guess it's not in every mission. It's in, if you're doing expeditions, which is like... Uh, basically areas that are off the main map, but they really wanted to make, I guess. Um, they put them into expeditions, which uh, are really cool. I really like them. Um, but you can't really stealth them because the whole point of them is to go in and pick up a uh... Yeah, this is a pretty worthless fucking sniping spot man Like really uh, Just double checking to make sure I don't have a long shot that I can go for from here But I'm not seeing Anything this wouldn't really make sense for a long shot because it we're in like a little valley so it wouldn't even be couldn't even be that long a shot unless he was way over there. I do like how the long shots are only there if you're in the sniper nest. It really makes it a lot um a lot better since, you know, in theory you might miss a sniper's nest. And or like go like in the last mission, right? Like we could have technically went a different way and ended up killing that guy that was for the long shot. Um before we even got to him. I, I could have swore that there was something that made noise here, but I guess not. Okay, so we could go through there. I doubt anyone's there. I'm still worried about that one guy that caught us. got more trucks here that I would like to blow up so what I might do is go this way yeah see there oh and there's actually a noisemaker there awesome so there is somebody over here now whether or not this is the same guy who saw us blow that other guy's head off I don't know oh, a wall. Okay, that's perfect. Ow, that was nonsense, and you know it. Now it does tell me to relocate, but by the looks of it, he, yeah, he was the last guy here. All right. So actually, the fact that no one else is coming for me means that I'm fucking good to go. And I can blast these trucks. Which is good. Oof. Oof. Now that should hopefully... Chain reaction? No? Really? But they are so close together, how can that not be a chain reaction? Oh, come on. Is. Oh, oh, oh. Wobble a bit. Oh, come on. Keeps popping up a little bit more than I expect it to. There we go. That truck. Just for the added experience. Not that it does a whole lot, but. And also, it really does nothing on this profile. Because I was going to say, because there is an achievement. Um, to uh, reach a certain rank, but obviously I'm not on my own account, so it doesn't really make a difference to me. 
Ow, what the fuck? Excuse me, how? In that, what? Oh god, I have to do this again. Okay, so apparently a fucking sniper showed up or something. I didn't fucking see. I don't know where the hell he was though. Unless like the explosions drew them in, but like let's open up this again for no real reason. Unless explosions drew them in, but I mean in general, they don't come from very far away is the thing, you know, like like pretty much if you can't like if they yeah. I mean, like, the maps are more or less divided into, like, I want to say, like, sections, right? And, like, if they're in a different section of the map, then they're not going to respond if uh, something happens in a different section, even if it is possible that they heard it. Like, those explosions could probably be heard from quite a ways away. Okay, so we'll wait for him to turn around, because apparently he does that. And if he doesn't turn around, then I'm calling, yeah, nonsense that he did last time. There we go. Okay, so like we're still gonna blow up the trucks. Just as the, the added fuck you to the to the Nazis here is just too much to. Uh, but you know what? We're gonna do it a little bit better. And just one shot them with the uh, armor piercing rounds. Now, granted, not the best use for armor-piercing rounds. When uh, oh, look at we just unlocked the gun that I'm using. Um, since you know I only can only bring ten armor-piercing rounds in with me, but I mean, it's very rare that you need to actually use them. I mean, obviously, if there's a tank, they're better to use, um, or like an APC or something. But for the most part, it's not necessary. Actually. Let me yeah, there's still no one up there, so it must have just been that I was just firing wildly and the game was like, alright, we gotta we gotta stop him. <laughs> Come on. I do find it strange how there is no like reload animation or anything for it, you know? Are you? Is that thing done making noise now or something? Hello? Are you really? Can I go? Aha, uh -huh, there's a guy. Hey, you, why aren't you? Oh god, I shouldn't have done that. Yeah, okay, so he's going to check out those explosions. Now that I can see him better, I'll go down and deal with him. It looks to be the only one. Uh, I don't know what I'm going to do about that last truck, though. Considering that my uh, noisemaker here has apparently fixed itself or something. And fixed its... Or I guess it just broke more, right? Oh, alright. Cool. Collectible. Why not? Uh, the project progresses well. Let Rommel have his little victories. If it means the Fuhrer grants me free reign. He sees Africa within the Reich's grasp and knows I can deliver that. And when I do, our strong stranglehold on Britain will be complete and that little man Churchill will beg for mercy. Ooh. Now it is risky running in this game, as you can tell. Because they do have fairly good hearing. Or, you know, women's. Oof, that was a lot of hits. Okay, so that guy must have came from that direction. Because I know that uh, one of the guns is over there, I think. 
Or you can... Oh, no, you. I think maybe you go that way and you can see the gun from there. Or something. I don't know. I remember being over there and I think you snipe across like a valley or some shit. Okay. Now I'm going to quickly check this place because there's supposed to be another collectible here and I didn't actually check inside. Uh, I don't think I got a collectible here, did I? Okay, where is it exactly? Okay, so which, wait, which one's Sniper Nest? Some color, okay, so blue is Sniper Nest, which is there. Okay, so no, the other one should be in this building. Oh wait, we got that one already. All right, so we got, yeah. Yeah, we're good on collectibles then, all right. Okay, so now we're gonna head this way and see what we can see. I'm trying to determine if the path up there actually does anything. It also says that I still have a dude back there to Is he like up there or something? I don't think I can get up there though. Clearly not in there, because otherwise he would have came and investigated the fucking explosion. I don't know. Sometimes the little arrows on the map I don't quite understand. Yeah, there's probably a bunch of guys over... Oh! Okay. Not gonna lie, I expected to be dead there. Uh, it doesn't look like I can actually make it all the way over there like that anyway. There's some more explosions, but they're firing their gun, which is good. Because then that means that it'll cover the sound of my shots. It could mask my shot. That was weird. Did he just shake off the first? Did I manage to hit the helmet, but not in a way that got his head? Because if so, damn. Now, where are they firing? Ah, oh, there it is. So that's what's firing right now. Should I switch my ammo back? Okay, wait for it. There it is. If it wasn't for the slow time, some of those, like that one there, I'm pretty sure it's just one big boom and then it's over. Like, uh, if it was so, like, if it wasn't for the slowdown time, that would be. Uh, very difficult to uh, to time properly. Can I snipe across a valley somewhere? I thought I could, but maybe not. Okay. Is wait for them to start the aim and goodbye to you. So clearly, I got the guys there. I got the trucks there, but I can't deal with those right now. Uh, I'm just looking at my mini map and looking at the uh, the arrows. So that one there would be the one that I already don't know where it is. That there's a bunch of people that way actually, because I think that might be where the, the other place is. I'm not. I've got three arrows there, and there's probably two guys on the gun. I saw one patrolling around it. Maybe. Yeah, I've got. Two guys on the gun. I could have swore I saw somebody else. Ah, there he is. Now, depending on where he is when they decide to shoot, I may be able to get him. Oh, this is looking good. Come on. There it is. Oh! That looked nasty. Oh, no, there's actually yet another guy in here. Whoops. Okay, so obviously that guy I'll just have to kill with them. I should be able to blow it all up in one go. Um, but I should probably check these buildings that I'm in first. Because I have killed a few guys, but I don't want to blow that up. 
without checking them first because I could very easily get screwed over by like the wrong guy. Although I guess if I blew them up with the noise mask, they would still hear the explosion, obviously. Um, but they would then go over there to investigate it. Oh. Oh, did they stop firing? Okay, against the wrong cover. Okay, get. Oh, that's unfortunate. It seems like they have stopped firing their gun. Hang on, I have to adjust my. Oh, my leg is going to sleep like a motherfucker. Oh god, that hurts. All right. Okay, so that guy saw him, but that's fine. Um, there is a collectible in one of these buildings here. God, why wouldn't you for a silent sniper rifle? Although, like I said before, a silent sniper rifle in this game would be ridiculous. Because just nothing would be able to stop you. Because thankfully, you know, unlike most games, if somebody sees somebody... Uh, it sees a dead body, they don't immediately know where the person who killed them was. Once again, another problem with uh, New Dawn, but you know, it's, uh, it's a problem with most open world stealth games in all honesty. They really have a hard time balancing that, that stealth mechanic. And I really have a hard time remembering that I need to hit a button to get on the ladder. Oh, fucking lawnmower's back. Okay. So it looks like I just have these three guys left. Uh, and I don't know if taking them out will also clear the objective or if I actually have to destroy the, uh, destroy the gun. I'm not sure on that. Oh, and there's another guy right there. See, I was worried that I had missed somebody. No. So as long as my magical marks that let me see them through walls. Uh, Miss it from home. Dear Ernst, the papers are full of news from the African front. We are proud that you are doing your bit for the Reich. Old Mrs. Ehrlich, sure, was most vigorous in her praise of Field Marshal Rommel and our fine boys. Your mother glowed with pride. She passes on her regards and asks that you give the British a good thrashing from her. Um, okay, let's see. He doesn't seem interested in moving, which is... Oh, there he goes. Which is apparently incorrect. He's going down. While there's like a well here, can I go anywhere if I drop down it? No. So, oh, but I can go down this way. Where's number four? Did, okay. He was just literally on top of another guy. All right. Okay, so I might actually be able to pop that guy through the bars. This guy is one of the gunners. Okay, so we have the two gunners, obviously, and then we have two patrolling officers. Oh. What? Excuse me. Do you mind just, like, fucking dying? Oh, that guy may have... But you know what? I'm actually going to head down further. Don't know if they can see down here, though. I mean, clearly they should be able to, but... Ooh, I wonder, will this blow up the whole thing? I mean, I'm going to try that. Wait, did I? Oh, no, it did go. Okay. I don't know if that'll work with those. I mean, it should... Oh, yeah, there it is. There's the timer. Yeah, you're right, it's probably nothing. Oh, I, I know, he's here's the thing from underneath. Oh god, look at that. That, wow, all right. Not very silent there, but you know, it worked. <laughs> like, damn. 
one down. Okay, so more. that guy's going down there to investigate, which makes sense. Because it's not like all of that can explode twice, right? There we go. Man, that's a, uh, a rather large hole I made there, isn't it? I don't know if, actually if I can pick up, like I brought armor piercing rounds in, but I don't know if I can also pick them up from random places or not. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I was going to say I feel like you can't, but I just honestly have no idea. Okay, so we got these guys here. I do have grenades. I could just take them both out, which I guess, and then we'll see if that alerts anyone let's see first of all any more okay no more collectibles or anything here so let's pop this grenade right there we'll get rid of both of them and it yeah see i didn't even get an alert that time which means there's literally no one there to hear me blow that up uh i'm still slightly worried about the arrows that are pointing this direction So you know what, I'm just gonna do this and see what happens. Although I guess if I do that, that doesn't necessarily like alert people maybe, I guess. I don't know why it wouldn't. It is a massive explosion, but you know, whatever. All right, now I'm just gonna chill here for a second to see if anyone comes to investigate the blowed up truck. So we got an entrance there and an entrance there that people can come from. How likely they are to come from either of them, I don't know. Um, I said I am a little worried about that. I'm assuming it was a sniper that took me out just because I don't know what else it could have been that take that took me out that quickly. And I just heard two shots. So unless there was a guy standing right next to me with a pistol, I feel like it had to have been a sniper, but we got all their trucks destroyed, which is good. Any like damage you can do to the military, to the army that you're fighting against is always good. Cause you know, they now have to replace that, which requires more money, more men, more materials, you know, get everything back up and running okay so there's two collectibles in the next section I guess like, like I said I don't think there's anybody in these tunnels but obviously they do come out in places where there are people um, I also don't know if there's anything that will dampen my noise here or not now there should be another collectible I guess I should check where I am um, a little bit further. Ah, over here in this camp. There it is. Uh, letters to Martin. Dearest Martin, I miss you terribly. The Woman's Land Army is grueling work. You'd hardly know me. Hitler may have his U-boat sinking food convoys, but I'm working from dawn to dusk milking cows and digging ditches. All for victory. Oh, Maisie and I are driving tractors now. Dad says that scares him more than Hitler does. Cheeky bugger. Uh, yours lovingly, Jane. All right. So this is some British guy, maybe a spy. Possibly, I guess. How he got a letter. I mean, I guess he could have got the letter and it, well, it would make more sense that he got the letter and then got to this position that he got the letter while he was there. Duh. Ugh, I can't believe that thought even passed through my mind. I feel like such an idiot. Anyway, 